crazy in the kitchen, bitch. I ain't even got my motherfucking order. Bitch, I ordered a motherfucking 10 piece lemon pepper oil flag. The fuck? Child. I said all motherfucking flags. Crispy bitch with ranch. What the fuck? What the fuck is going on with the community? Lord, it's no, it's all hell. The kitchen burned down? Oh my Lord, they didn't tell me that's why I didn't get my water. The kitchen burned down. Hey, Shay Shay, hey everybody, what's up y'all? Make sure y'all double tap on the screen, sharing the live. Um, queen of the evening. <laughs> Say, I'm trying to get it where I fit in. No shade, because yesterday I was just blocked off. Like, y'all, I tried to help the panel. I had number 500 views, girl. I'm, they was like, girl, she a flop. Da, da, da. I'm like, damn. I'm trying to get it where I fit in. So I'm kind of happy Hell's Kitchen is over. So that does leave a, a little gateway for me to kind of get on live. Because y'all know what Hell's Kitchen on, it be like, they have all the views and stuff. So now that it's over, I can start coming on in the morning time. So I'm actually happy that it's over. No shade, because it was kind of like taking over. The morning shit. So I'm happy that shit is over. No shade. And it's over as soon as they got started getting gifted, y'all. They just was starting to reap the, the benefit fruits of their of their labor. Cause y'all know for a long time they would sit on, on Hell's Kitchen and you know they'll sit on five K beans to ten K beans and I will read them about that. So they was just now starting to reap the benefits of their of their fruit. Hey Shy. So to see them in I'm um I'm sad about, I'm sad for Lady Red because I know that was like her thing and they worked so hard for it, but I'm happy on Rose of the, Rose's part. So that's why y'all be hearing like really two sides, that come, two sides, uh, um, it's two, it's going to be two sides, you guys. So it's going to be the side I'm coming from where I'm like, I fuck with Lady Red, that's my girl. And it's the other side, so I don't really give a fuck about Rosa. Or what happens to him or what he loses. And it's so crazy how his fall is like his demise. Like he was up and up and he fell so fast. He just started getting his shit together. He losing family members, losing show people. What is going on? I am so happy Hell's Kitchen is over. So now I can start going live at 11, 12, 1, 2, or 3. I am so happy it's over. No shade. Let's get a round of applause for that, y'all. I'm so happy. Hell, it's no shade. I'm like, damn, how long they gonna have this show? So now maybe we can, like, it's, it gives a new wonder for other people. Maybe me and some and some more content creators can work together to fill in that time slot. Um, maybe me and, I don't know, maybe me and Stormy can collab and do, like, a morning. That would be cute, right? Me and Stormy in the morning time. Thank you, Eddie. And thank you, baby. Baby, me and Stormy can do something in the morning times. Me and Drake, baby, don't really be up in the morning time. But I need to find some morning shit, morning fish, because y'all know I do like late nights. But now that the Hell's Kitchen is over, I'm definitely moving to morning shift because that time slot needs to be filled. That's like four or five hours because y'all know they do the uh, Hell's Kitchen for six, seven hours. Me and Madam Lowe. I don't know. I feel like me and Madam Lowe would have to get to know each other more. Like we like we know each other, but we don't know know each other. And I feel like we don't be around each other enough to kind of see how we click. Like, you know, I have to feed off the person that I'm co-hosting with. And I don't know how how we vibe together. It's not gray hair, it's blonde. It's like a platinum blonde, but it probably looked gray mixed in with the um the black. Just a little accent. But yeah, um, so, yes, Hell's Kitchen is over. We're trying to figure that out. Like, how are we going to fill that time slot? Stormy and Coco's forecast. Well, it wouldn't be a forecast because that's Stormy theme. And so, I don't want to... I know Stormy's having a hard time right now with, like, people trying to take her stuff, I guess. Or not being in control or nothing. Because, you know, if, if I if I come in on Stormy, Coco's and Stormy forecast, it's going to turn into my show. No shame. So, I want us to scratch that. Because that's flopping anyway. I'm not joining nothing that's already a flop. Flop, as I mean, she do have her views, but she's not getting supported. The same thing with Hell's Kitchen. You girls are doing too much content and not enough benefits. And y'all know what it could be too is, it's like, the gifters might don't want to give people just talking shit about other people. That's why I'm glad I'm the type of girl where I am the content. I get discussed on these T-shows. 
Because it's like, girl, we gifting you like for shit for other people's content. But I get it. I get it. Everybody wants to tell tea and review tea and da 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 da. When I talk my shit, I just talk my shit. Like you know, regular you know program is that it's just me. I'm I'm talking my shit. Hey BJ, what's up, baby? Yes, y'all. So I named I named the title Hell Snow Kitchen for a reason because Rosa has been on this smear campaign for like the past like ever since I felt like I started having somewhat of a name on the app to try and tear me down. Um, it is. It, y'all keep saying it's not over. It is over. Hell's Kitchen is over. So y'all can get on my comments then. Oh, they changed the name. He even hired Milan. It's another show. It's a new name. It's somewhere else. It's on a new channel. It's 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 new people. It's got picked up. It's new shows. It's new. It's not over. It's over. Hell's Kitchen is over. It's done. Y'all talking about five? It was five thousand view, views for Mez because we wanted a T. And the only reason he was getting gifted because those was family, all those was get family gifts. Those was not peer support gifts. Those was shit he just sent out to his family. Shout out to him for getting eight boxes and having 5,000 views. But it was because we wanted to see. Y'all think Milan and motherfucking Rose going to be able to hold those motherfucking views for the rest of however long. I don't know how long Hell's Kitchen was on, but I know they had a long, long run. They are not going to be able to keep views that long. Milan is boring as fuck. No shade. All he do is talk about Bad Boys Club. And then stay as musky as Rob in that weak ass arcade with them LED lights. Like he uh a teenager. You are old ass man, Milan. You need to have some nice chairs in there, some cigars, some cognac. Like grow the fuck up. Well, Kex, you are in my live. You saying I'm boring, but bitch, you in my motherfucking live, you weak ass bitch. You watching me. Bitch, I don't know what the fuck you look like. But you know me. Like the fuck I said, Hell's Kitchen is over. The only people, the only reason he had them views today is because we wanted to know the school. We wanted to see, the tea was dry as fuck. The tea was dry as the fuck. No shade, it was boring as fuck. It was no kiki moments. No shade, we all know that Lady Red was the salt of the show. Lady Red was the salt of the show. No shame. And he better be motherfucking grateful that Lady Red did that show. Because uh, motherfucking Rose, you was blacklisted, boo. There wasn't nobody fucking with you. Nobody tuning in to you. Nobody wanted nothing to do with your snake ass because that's what you are, a motherfucking snake. You are a fucking snake, a motherfucking defendant turned witness. You motherfucking weak ass, fraudulent ass bitch. A defendant turned weakness. That was Lady Red show. She had the screen records. She had the tea. She backed your corny ass up, bitch. He was definitely blackballed. And it's no shame. I'm so happy Rosa is getting all this is happening to him. Because like I said, Rosa has been preying on my downfall trying, to, downfall, trying to tear me down every chance he got for the past couple of months. Even trying to come in between me, me and Tay relationship. That's once I had saw that Tay and Rosa was sisters or whatever they they could country country they locked in or sisters for life. I kind of backed away, no shade, because I I can tell Rosa. I feel like he probably would if I would have went around and fed into that situ to that stuff. I don't know where me and Tay would have been today. So I had definitely once I saw they were getting closer or whatever they got going on, I definitely backed away. Because I, I see everything Rosa was doing. I see how he was trying to plant little seeds here and there. I see how he was trying to put stuff in Tay head. They're trying to like pin us against each other. So I'm like, you know what? I'm I'm not about to do that. I, I love me and Tay's friendship. And I'm not about to fall out over Rosa. No shame. And I get it. And, and I hope Tay was keeping his head, bitch. I keep my friends close, but I keep my motherfucking enemies closer. I hope that's how my bitch was thinking. I hope that's how my bitch was thinking. You keep your friends close, you keep your motherfucking enemies closer. You keep them bitches, you keep them bitches right there in your back pocket. Dumb ass. I hope that's how my sister was rolling. I hope that's how my sister thinking. So I was like, I'm gonna let her work her set. I'm 
talking the fuck about it. I took that for what it was and I paid it. I know she don't fucking like Rosa. Don't nobody like Rosa. That's why he lost all the motherfucking family members, bitch. That was Lady Red show and that was Pacho family, bitch. Because Pacho definitely was reviving that family, carrying it on his back, recruiting motherfuckers left and right. Rosa is a shisty, sneaky, conniving, felon ass bitch. If you can rob from the dead, it's nothing. You, it's nothing. It's not, no lines you won't cross. If you can rob the dead, if you can, y'all, so y'all know Rosa was the man when they had the Orlando 50, when they shot up that club in Orlando and all those people died. Rosa was out here making GoFundMe and taking the money for his own motherfucking beneficial. He was motherfucking making GoFundMe for them dead people. Yes. He was making GoFundMe for them dead people that lost their life in the motherfucking Orlando club. When they killed, when they killed all them gay people. Y'all remember that? Pulse Club. Go look it up. It's all there. Look it up. He was tried, convicted, and served time and everything. Go look it up. Them people lost their life in that nightclub, Pulse nightclub in Orlando. Go look. I think it was the Orlando 50 people that got killed. And he went and made gun for GoFundMe for all them people without their family recognition or authorization or nothing. That's that's how low how low can you go? But how lower can you go from robbing dead people? He stole all that money, y'all. He didn't even send the family no flowers. He didn't pay for the casket. He didn't send no motherfucking car. And the least you could have did, that's the motherfucking least you could have did. You fat fuck. That is like that's what I said. I cannot fuck with no person like that at all. And y'all gotta watch how Rosa move. He moves so shisty. He moves so, so shisty. Like I told y'all, he's a motherfucking witness turned offended. And where I'm from, shit like that gets you knocked off. That's why I'm saying I don't do this big old factory shit. I don't do this shit because I it's like street cold, and I be lit. I be going by that like on here. Shit like a a, a wit defendant turned witness, bitch. That shit get you knocked off. Bitch, that, you, you get found stinking somewhere. No, I don't know where y'all are from, but where I'm from, bitch, you a defendant turned witness. Bitch, that means you run your motherfucking mouth too fucking much. That means you talking to the cops. That means you telling. And where I'm from, that gets you off. And no shade, Rose, you better watch the fuck out. Because Jason Lee ain't too broke. Jason Lee got some connections. I ain't saying I'm just saying, but I'm just saying. Go be found stinking in a motherfucking swamp somewhere. Defendant turned witness. That mean you motherfucking snitching. So you got this girl fired and now you trying to help her get rehired. What kind of motherfucking shit is that, you fat fuck? That's why I can't wait for the I'm I can't wait till the family keep on falling. No shade. No shade, Rosa. That's what happens. That's what happened when you build shit from shit. You went and started this motherfucking fool out of our family. Picked up all these motherfucking flop ass hoes, these late girls that nobody knows. Try to pick like girl what? A bunch of fools in the fool la lies. If they, if y'all in those shades, to anybody in the fool lies, if y'all sit here and follow with Rosa and support that trash, I cannot wait till he burn y'all. Rosa's type of person, he only thinks about himself. He don't act like he doesn't show anyone any type of loyalty. It's no motherfucking shade. And I'm so glad that Lady Red quit because I always wonder like why he always hosting. Like he will always most time have more beans than her. Um, you know, he'll like have more to say. Like you can tell he was trying to like, you know, daughter her on the show at times. So I'm like, girl, why you don't host it sometimes? Like, da, 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 da. It's no shame. And it's, I feel like Lady Red, I think Hell's Kitchen, it was, at first, I thought it was a bad idea because, as you all know, Lady Red is really cool with Tay, such as myself. And the whole, during the time, it was Rosa and Tay going at it. So I, at that, even before, at that time, I was like, I just didn't think it was a good move. Like, because I, I, I saw this, I already saw all this happening. I just saw, I saw all this happening in, like the whole demise of Hell's Kitchen because it wasn't built off. It was, it was built like wrong. They did not like each other. They were not cool. 
But once Red has said she did speak, and regardless of what y'all say, it's like lap dogs and this and that. I felt like as a person, Lady Red did say she speak with Tay, spoke with Tay and he said it was okay. He wasn't going to feel no type of way. And y'all can say this or say that or whatever, whatever. But I'm just a loyal person. If I'm loyal to somebody, they fuck with me. You know, and I, I feel like I can run something about them. I'm going to do it. So after she ran about him and whatever, he said it was cool. They did it. Cool, whatever. But me personally, I still would have did it. And for you to add Milan to the show, really? Like, first of all, y'all are too motherfucking old. Y'all are too motherfucking old. Y'all are both 30 plus on an app. Talking about people, a T-show. Like, I just cannot. I just cannot. Too old facts. Milan, you fucked out. They got your booty hole going all around, bitch. Look, look, like what? Bitch, your booty hole got its own zip code, Milan. You need to worry about that. Y'all, and that's the thing. Y'all are too old to be worried about big old. If I'm on big old, y'all, at that, that old age, that big age, please read me. Please give me up. If I'm motherfucking 30 plus, 35 still on here, reading, talking about AIDS and HIV and stuff, please get, please be in my account, report me. Bitch, do what you gotta do to get me off this app. And I'm telling y'all this. No shade. Like, yeah. like, don't send me no beans. Don't support me. If I'm 30 plus up here still, and I ain't got shit else going on but to talk about some motherfucking people in their early 20s. Come on now. Y'all are, it's so sad. It is sad to look at. It's motherfucking sad to look at. It's no shame. But you know what? All I got to say is, um, God ain't done with Rose again. Y'all think him losing the show, losing the family. He not done with him. He lost his men. He lost his house. Rosa, you are an evil person. So all of that shit is coming. And you're evil outside. I'm like, Rosa is the evil person outside of the app. I don't think that's what y'all understand. We might do our stuff up here and... Um and read and do his stuff, but Rosa is an evil person outside of the app. If you can rob, he, and honestly, he probably still getting karma for the what he did to them people in Orlando. Honestly, he might get fifty people. I don't know how many GoFunds me GoFund me he made, but he they definitely hunt him. What she see said, I just went live. Rosa on seven box. You on two stars? Sound like heavy. bitch. I just went motherfucking live. And I'm pretty sure if I go trade, if I get a family full of a family full of hoes and trade with them, I will be there too. But my family, I don't have any hosts in my family, babe. So it's all peer support over here. Okay? So when Rosa get out and flop ass hosts out his family and have just his supporters like me, his family like me, then we can fucking talk. It's nothing for us to talk about. Nothing for us to talk about. I'm not going around the app. Looking for people to join my family because it's flopping. Bitches want to join my motherfucking family. I'm turning down and I'm declining applications, bitch. We are closed. That's what's going on over here. We turning down applications. I'm not going around here trying to find fly bigger hosts and revive them. How you gonna revive somebody, Rosa? You dead yourself. You dead your motherfucking self. And this is to all the bitches. Y'all have to realize. Y'all have to do more than talk about people. A lot of these bitches can now cannot entertain a motherfucking audience without talking about the next bitch. Thank you, Ninja. That like that's all we know Rosa for. That's all we know her for. We don't know him for, like that's all we know him for. They be born as fuck on solos. We know it like that's how you can tell who your real big old host star. And who your girls will really entertain. I can sit on my solo live and talk to my comments and do 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 for hours and hours and hours and hours and hours. I don't have to bring up the next bitch. I don't have to talk. If you find it interesting, you find it interesting. You don't, you don't. But these girls, they don't, they cannot bring in 1K, 2K, 3K if they're not talking about the next bitch. No shade. And Rosa, I don't know what you're gonna do because your tea is late. No shade. Whatever show Lady Red doing, that's what I'm going to be supporting. That's what I'm going to be watching. If she wants me to come and guest star, whatever, tune or whatever, I'm definitely down to go and support her. Um, but like I said, I'm glad it's over. No shade because there was, there was definitely one of the longest running shows. 
So I was like, damn, like everybody go think it's the best thing that's ever happened. So it's like I'm I'm happy it came to a halt before it got too 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 big, like too much. You know what I'm saying? They probably about to get sponsorships and all type of shit. My face full of makeup. Why do you care? I don't know, y'all. Let's take a sip. This is we're so y'all. This is a celebration. We're celebrating an end to Hell's Kitchen. It's over. Thank you for the gift, baby. Donna is done. Donna got dead. We are celebrating, y'all. We are. It's a celebration today, y'all. It's nothing to be said about. It's nothing to be worried about. This is a great thing, y'all. This is new doors about to open. This is new opportunities. This is a great thing for me. Because if Coco wins, then all of y'all get in meeting. We're celebrating the, the, the Fall of Hell's Kitchen. We're celebrating Pancho and everybody leaving. Rosa's family. Ooh. My mouth gets so watery when I be uh, taking sips, y'all. It is over, y'all. It's over. I'm so, I'm so, like, I don't think y'all understand how ecstatic and excited that I am that that show is over. I was so tired of waking up in the morning and that was the only show that was on, girl. I was like, damn, they got all the connections. And then, and then when they talk about the story, they had the bitches coming up. I'm like, damn, they got all the, the sources. They got all the receipts. They really got that shit together. And then I try to read them about using the teeth clock. I was like, all y'all do is use the teeth clock and use the tea from the tea page. Bitch, they done went and made their whole page. They all paid tea page. I said, fuck. Damn. I said, I know you motherfucking lying. They done had went and got their own page. I, I read them about that. I read them about not getting gifted. They started getting gifted. I said, God damn. I'll be damn. So, thank, I'm just happy my, my, y'all don't know how long I've been waiting on that show to end. Y'all just don't understand. I have been, because that was like one of the, the strongest things going right now. Especially on our side. The power of the tongue. It is over. It is over. Hell's Kitchen is over. Y'all think that shit gonna motherfucking work with Milan and motherfucking Rosa? No, it's not. And I'm gonna make sure it don't work. I'm on a motherfucking mission. I'm on a motherfucking mission to make sure it don't motherfucking work. If I have to sit in that live every motherfucking day and get on 10 foo-foos, 60 foo-foos, bitch, to send those voice gifts, it, you go into a single live. Bitch, this won't be... No. I'm gonna make it difficult. Because now Lady Red is not on the show. I don't have no motherfucking regards. I don't have no hoes, bitch. I'm 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 going I'm going that extra mile to make sure that that show does not succeed. Now I'm on a minute. Now I mean it. I'm on Lady Red's side, bitch. You fuck with Lady Red, you don't fuck with me, bitch. I mean it. Cause bitch, you been fuck with me for a long time, ho. So now that I got somebody to back me up that hate you as equal as I do, oh baby, it's oh baby, uh, uh, coach, put me in the game. Team Lady Red, bitch. We taking her down. Donna is down. Donna is down. Team Lady Red, bitch. I'm gonna make. We're gonna make it our mission. That that show does not touch them. Hell, it's over. It's, uh, and I'm on a mission. I'm on a mission. Now I'm in it. Cause I need a storyline. And. Is that really okay, girl? So mind you, I just stumbled into her live and I didn't even know what the tea was. But bitch, Rosa called me yesterday asking me to co-host Hell's Kitchen, and I was like, "What about Lady Red?" And he was like, "I don't know what she got going on or something." I'm thinking that girl, she just wasn't coming to the show. They done fully fell out. Girl, Hell's Kitchen is over. I didn't like... even know the teas. So Thank mind you, girl, Rosa was trying to get me to co-host. And now you finna co-host on Lady Red show? Well, I haven't talked to her officially um, about whether I co-host or not, but like I said, I'm definitely in her corner 100% of so whether it's co-hosting or just promoting for her and just being in the comments and support her. I'm gonna support her. Um, okay, period. When you and Lady Red become besties? Um, me and Lady
Kelly Ray always been like good. I wouldn't say like besties, girl, but we always been like, you know, good. Like she don't play on my side, I'm playing on hers, and we kicking and she right. gives me, I give her, you know, it's it's no energy. Okay. I'm definitely gonna um, you know, watch from the sidelines and see how this plays out because it's gonna be interesting. Girl, very interesting. It's a lot of girls like Listen, I'm, stop being messy. I can do what I want, ho. And but I'm just getting that shit about Rose it. was like his demise, like so fast. And I don't know why you sitting that fat hoe on motherfucking yacht. Like he really deserved it. Cause it was that I was ready for the show. It was a key key. Like no she, no shade. Like bitch. Baby, you should have never that, that, that shit to that fat ass flop. You know, I got coins, so I don't mind expending it sometimes. And they be the hoes that claim they don't like me the most. They comment about me in every live. Like, bitch, what's y'all problem? <laughs> 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 like, bitch, come on now. You know how that is, girl. What's the team like on the updates? Like, what's the updates on your show? Fuck another bitch show. Um. So, are you like healed and like? Everything. Yeah, I'm okay. healed enough. I've been streaming and shit. I'm just not hosting this month on Big O. I'm gonna make a group chat with us, and um, somebody just added me to a. Did somebody just add you to a group in WhatsApp? Mm, I don't know. I don't got WhatsApp notifications on. They just added me a group to a group, and it said Big O Top Broadcasters. But um, I'm gonna make us a group chat. And I still got to find two other ladies. Okay. And who was those ladies? I don't know. I know it would probably it would probably be two cisgender women though. I would prefer. Coco not active enough, bitch. I be live every fucking day. What? How much more active you want me to be? You want me to go live when I'm taking a shit? When I'm getting fucked? When I'm sucking dick? Cam was on season one, y'all. I'm not bringing back anyone from season one cast. I'm I'm scraping it clear, bringing in new girls, out with the old, in with the new. Y'all okay. saying trigger, but we already the okay. So this is the purpose, y'all. It's girlfriends, not training talk. So I want to have a balance of cisgender women and trans women. I don't feel like trans women could represent girlfriends completely. Me and Camera are not really in the best space right now. Leah don't. Leah is stupid and retarded, and need to go have an abortion. Oh, well, I ain't saying all that. I am. <laughs> Everybody don't need to be parents. Somebody need to go hit that hole in the stomach with a baseball bat. And to save everybody a lot of trouble. What? Yeah. JP, come on now. Not Coco. Thank you, Pacho. Pacho, send me one more. Send me one more, Pacho. You know I got you on the back end. Yesterday, I was, like, struggling. Mm-hmm. What about Shiny? Yeah, okay. um, I'm going to think about it. I'll, I'll, we'll talk about it. I want to see what JB's mm-hmm. saying. But we'll just we'll see y'all. But I like the names, the names y'all are saying, the suggestions. I think I want to do a panel called Training Talk. You going to come? <laughs> yeah, I told y'all would. Oh, girl, yuck. <laughs> mm-hmm. Hello, ladies. Hey, Pacho. Hello, ladies. What's up, you bald head, turtleneck, dick having bitch? <laughs> JVs, can you be nice for once? God no, damn. I can't. I don't fuck with you, ho. You let Listen. that these dark leg having ass so kick me off your <laughs> Wait, so you still have to forgive him, Pancho? Absolutely she fucking not. not. This bitch she practically begged the queen to get on the panel and then let this bum oh, ass bitch. Oh, please. Let's go. Now it's up for No shade, Pancho. That, that was high. late. And the only reason I didn't get in your mug because everybody else already was. But I was definitely <laughs> going to get in your mug. Because I'm like, because oh I didn't even God. say nothing to do nothing. Okay, so listen. Because um, I'm like, is it the dick or what? Because, I mean, if that's the case, I mean. The dick is dicking. But listen, uh, Coco. Um, we, I, I mean, <laughs> I'm, I'm pretty out, babe. Oh, Coco, they did just add me to it. Whatever that is. Mm. What they talking about? The girl, I see a couple familiar numbers. I might need to leave up out of there. Okay. I don't know what the fuck is going on. I don't want these hoes having my numbers. So, Coco, what I did wanted to come up here for is to invite you to a, sh- a special show. Um, we need a female perspective. Um, it's called Toxic Tendency. It's me, Bone Crusher, and Maniac. If you click on the flyer, um, the first uh, the first picture on my profile, mm-hmm. it's going to be a lit-ass show. 
It's going to be one guest female every episode, and we would love for you to be an uh, episode for on on the next episode on Friday um, to give a female perspective of sex relationships and your perspective on men. Lose the show. And when is the show? Friday. Right, at what time? Friday, 3 p.m. 3 p.m. This Friday, yeah. 3 p.m.? Toxic Tendencies. Wait, Friday, 3 p.m. I should be back home. Hopefully, I'm back home. Everybody want to do a motherfucking show and talk about how they bottom and don't douche and they know they body. We're not talking about that. We're not talking about that, JVs. We're not talking about that. Like, we're like, we're not not talking about that. <laughs> like what the fuck? Because I know Friday morning. I didn't bottom and don't Friday douche. Friday morning, I got an um, appointment. Lizzie, shut the fuck up. I spit on you, ho. Who? That bitch in the comments. She claims she don't like me, but always got something to say to me. That hoe really be one my attention. I'm going to give it to you, bitch. You are a fat bitch. You are a motherfucking flop, and you are the remnant of a motherfucking support group that is no longer Toxic even on this app. Tendencies. So you just all over this bitch trying to find some type of relevance from the Toxic I'm not gonna tendencies. Give it. Oh my god! And pay you. I don't know why you sick of me. You need to be sick of your motherfucking fave getting stabbed and shot up, bitch. Toxic tendencies. But Blaine, can you get me? I don't back for me. And I just went live. You sick of that, bitch? Oh, toxic thank tendencies. you. Thank you, Big D. JB's, do you do you think that you have toxic tendencies, baby? Pacho, do you oh, think man. you got a bald motherfucking head and a cheesy ass dick? Uh, uh, I just don't got no haircut right now. <laughs> oh my god, you got on a two No blame. Send me one tooth that you no, talk about since you want to run your mouth. Girls from the scalp. I got a little hair fiber like Zay, but we all do the same thing. You know, that's it. To be fair, you are fat. Tell that hoe Kevin. Kevin, kick him. I'ma send Coco a Dragon. Pacho is not kick who. Well, I kick him for that. Uh-huh. Cool. You know how I give it up. Don't really take too much length off of it, though. Just blunt clip it at the bottom. You said Glizzy? Thank you, Pacho. Thank you, thank you. But, Pacho, I think I should be back home by that time, Friday. Okay. Is Coco, don't go on their show. Why not? If Pacho is like... Let's fuck them. Negative. When I fuck them, I fuck I'm with Bone. I'm cool with I'm Maniac, super girl, fuck Pacho. I like he Pacho. let us get kicked by that dark leg bitch. He, he did he let us get kicked. on another one of his panels. Did you, did you get kicked Coco too? Yeah, for nothing. And I was quiet, not saying nothing. Like, nothing. we are fucking royalty. This I'm is a good. lack of I'm respect. Like, I make up for it in gifts. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm over it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm holding grudges. Fuck all you hoes. <laughs> JB's is cool, you know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying. Pacho burning hell. <laughs> Time is yeah. Time is all Wait, so wounds. Pacho, like, what's next for you? Because like, you are, you definitely like. No shame, Pacho. Regardless of what people say about you or whatever, you have been shaking it for these past couple of like little ones too, with the whole my line <laughs> thing, with your page game thing. Mm-hmm. What the fool of that shit. Girl, y'all call anything motherfucking shaking it, bitch. No, she has, she has, baby. No she held, she held 2,000 views for an hour. Because ain't nobody else on this bitch no, <laughs> no more. Y'all just call has, everything shaking it, bitch. Polls get posted on the Trinities one time and now they shaking the app. I'm so And y'all in the comments talking about girl anything, but y'all be the same ones in the comments. No shade, no shade, or when nobody have nothing. Girl, look at that shit. No, hold it's on, okay. or as soon as nothing, okay. is, nothing is going on, y'all be the ones saying bitch if or it's not, If it's not in JB's world, it don't register. But you know, and none of you hoes are in my world. Bitch or bitch. I'm now, the king. It takes for, take for Maniac almost to get shot in the middle of the street for y'all to say big old Now, old. Maniac shook it up. Bitch shooting at a hoe in broad daylight, that was shaking it up. Pacho having a fucking panel with dark leg cherry. Bitch, that's not shaking it. Like, come on. Like, we just well, no, not shaking the title. Too. Thank you, yeah. Brad. She stuck on that. That, that panel Brad. hurt. That panel hurt Brad. her. Brad. It didn't hurt me, but I'm going to read you about it every time I see you because that's why I don't like you, bitch. You can't so, read me, JBs. Please, are you I didn't do anything kidding me? You're to very you. easily read. Uh, you're very easily read. You you're 30 years old. Baby. You're in a two-bedroom apartment. One of you <laughs> I'm in a house. Room. You sleep I'm in a house. house. LED lights, red LED lights. I'm in a house. You on your bald-ass motherfucking forehead all day. No LED you lights. You coloring in that motherfucking hairline with Beijing and Sharpie markers <laughs> because that shit is doing the one-two way back and fading out like Thanos snapped it. All right, you it's ready? Really you got to mute her after I'm done. Chance. You're very readable. So the beard is patchy. Let me go. Let me get it. Let me get it. Let me get it.
Let me like, get her next. Let me get her. Back in the let me get her. And he didn't let me get, get her. Bad. Let me get her. Let me get her. Do you really believe that, JB? Where motherfucking hair? That's a toupee. <laughs> that shit gonna come right off. <laughs> Why did you argue between your motherfucking lace front, Miss Pacho, bitch? I have no idea, baby. Better go they grab be that so motherfucking mad. black spray paint and fill that shit in, fuck nigga. They be, re they be repeating what Milan say. Not arguing with a Damn, bitch. Got motherfucking Damn, subway baby, surface motherfucker. graffiti on her motherfucking forehead. Cherry the boom yeah. ate her ass so bad up that day. She was so upset. Goodness gracious, she uh -oh. cannot get over it. Goodness gracious, you falling apart and busting out the scene at the end of the day. What? I'm just stop. Out the scene. I'm just stop. The scene is falling apart. Goodness what? Gracious. Bitch, she's. I still love her. Out. So you are gutted, though, Oh, they said, wait, they said Cherry is a Jill. I'm still swollen today. Oh, not me. I never caught an STD in my life. Wait, y'all, yeah, I like Cherry. They said Cherry got arrested. Bro, that ain't what I heard. All you hoes be fucking in the same circle. So if, as far as I'm concerned, oh, not me. one bitch got it, y'all. I ain't wait, never, I ain't never ever fuck in the same circle. Girl, y'all be fucking in the motherfucking loop, bitch. Instead of playing Rick Ross, Rosie, y'all know I love showing my entire my chart, baby. I've never ever caught a disease. You can't read me with your teeth, baby girl. You're not about to go. You can't go argue with me, baby girl.